Hi, and welcome to another MI How To video. My name is Tom Clark. I'm your host, and on today's How To, we're going to be talking about the smart sensor for mounted bearings from ABB. And helping us out is Corey. Coburn. Corey, welcome. Hey, how's it going? It, it, this is great. I, I love this little animal right here. I'm not sure what you've got for us, but I know we're talking about smart sensors for mounted bearings, right? Today we're going to discuss how applying a wireless sensor to dodge roller bearings provides operational excellence and increased safety for end users. I like the word safety right there because we talk about it all the time. We have our PPE on set just in case. We're not going to really need it for this demo, but remember, whatever the job calls for, make sure you're wearing the proper PPE because we want to keep everybody safe. All right, where do we start? So let's start with these bearings. Okay. These are mounted roller bearings and they're across a lot of different industries. Aggregate, cement, paper and pulp, mining, and even food and beverage customers all utilize mounted roller bearings. Regardless of the brand, they all need normal maintenance like visual inspection and regreasing. Yeah, now that looks very familiar because we have shown these in the past talking about how to properly maintain them, but what's really different now? So the customer's gonna get the same quality bearing that they're used to from Dodge, right. but they can now enhance this bearing with an ABB smart sensor. The smart sensor is going to go into the side of the housing and it's a wireless product. So there's a built-in battery and the battery life is going to be approximately two years. All right, well, let's talk more about the sensor then. How does it actually help the customers? So through Bluetooth, it provides measurements of temperature and vibration. These two parameters provide key indicators to the current condition of the product. These readings are then sent to the app on the phone of the maintenance person responsible for the bearing. This is compatible with iOS and Android-based devices. Excellent. So the sensor sends everything that they need, all that info to the app or the iPad. I like it. What happens next? The ABB smart sensor for mounted bearings collects vibration data, which is analyzed within the ABB ability portal, indicating normal operation or an increasing likelihood of bearing failure. Knowing the current conditions helps direct the proper maintenance action needed. It also provides information to the maintenance manager, informing him when it doesn't need to be maintained. Okay, so that's what you're talking about improving operationally, correct? Correct. If the bearing is operating within normal conditions, no additional maintenance is needed. I like it. Well, can we crank it up? Yeah, so let's get this thing started. Okay. So this is a simulation of a belt conveyor often found in aggregate plants. All right. Here we have sensors mounted onto the bearings. Yeah, I see all four of them right yeah, there. Yeah, so okay. that, that data information is going to come into the iPad and we can view it on a portal or we can go to the internet. So okay. if you want to click on Chrome. All right. Okay, oh. and we're seeing temperature and vibration. Temperatures in blue. We did a test and heated up this bearing and you can see that there was a spike. Um, we also had to ship this demo and you can see here that it was a bumpy ride from the vibration reading. Little off-road action there. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> so now let me ask you this. The bearings are spread across a large quarry or across a large plant. What's the actual distance capability of the sensor transmitting? So typically we can support up to 24 feet. Certainly this may vary based on walls or machinery that may be in the way. Okay, now I see we have a heat spike, so something has to be done, right? You gotta take some action. Yeah, correct. So based on the reading, we can see that action needs to be taken and we can then reference the instruction manual for that needed action. If this were to be an out of tolerance signal for vibration, the maintenance manager might begin to locate a replacement bearing. They would schedule a period to swap out the bearing at the next most convenient time. Uh, yeah, better to do that before failing because downtime is extremely expensive. Well, I, I mean, I can see how this would help identify proper maintenance, but what about those applications where they're, I've got multiple mounted bearings way far away in another plant, or I've got multiple mounted bearings way far away in a large quarry. How am I gonna handle that? Yeah, that's a great question. So we have available a gateway okay. connection for remote accessibility. Okay. The gateway receives that operating signal from the bearing and then transmits the data to the cloud location. Uh -huh. The customer is going to simply access the cloud for the bearing and for all their bearings to their computer system. Kind of like a router extension at a home just to get that signal further out there. Yep. I like that. So the data can be accessed locally by the app or data can be transmitted by gateway up to the cloud location. Then the customer can do it on the iPad or the phone, correct? Yep, that's correct. Okay. Now let's talk about the safety aspect. Now, how does that actually come into play with the sensor? Yeah. So that's a great question. So these sensors are able to get the, the health of the bearing. So a maintenance person is no longer having to climb up catwalks or move over machinery. Okay because they can access that information on the ABB Ability Portal. They also move to predictive maintenance, meaning action is taken only when it is necessary. Getting the current
current bearing status is safer since there are fewer physical trips to inspect the bearing. Yeah, I don't want to be climbing up and down a ladder too many times. All right, so let's talk about it in summary. Let's see if I get this right. We have the ABB Ability Platform. Okay, we have the mounted bearings with the sensors, and the sensor provides feedback. I can either go to the app, the iPhone. I have the gateway that I can use for bigger distances, it's up in the cloud, so the customer can pull that data down so we get proper maintenance. And the use of the gateway allows also for multiple bearings to be monitored at the same time. Also, safety-wise, no climbing, no extra maintenance, so less time for them trying to do that physical stuff, so I'm gonna be safer in the long run for the technicians, correct? You're exactly right. Oh, awesome, good stuff. Corey, thank you very thank much. You. That's Corey Coburn with ABB talking about the smart sensor for mounted bearings. Any questions? Call your nearest Motion Industries branch location. They'll be able to help you out. As you notice, we talked about PPE earlier. Didn't need it for this, but you need it for whatever the job calls for. Stay safe with PPE. That's priority number one. Number two, check out more videos just like this one right here with great information. Go to mihowto.com. You'll find them there with me, Tom Clark, as your host. Thanks for watching.